What is up guys, Zack Scott here playing Pokemon. Let's go Pikachu and I made it to Cerulean City. And so let's talk to some people. This guy has a lollipop and a whip. I don't know what he's trying to get. Uh, your Pikachu looks very promising. Is that a girl? I can't tell. Guy or girl? I'm pretty sure that Pikachu can learn a marvelous move that I developed. Do you want me to teach a marvelous move to Pikachu? What do you say? You're creepy, but yes. Sure, absolutely. Learn Zippy Zap. P-Dog wants to learn the move Zippy Zap. Should an old move be forgotten and replaced with Zippy Zap? Uh, sure, why not? Maybe Zippy Zap does what exactly? Uh, it is, oh, a power of 50. And the user attacks the target with burst of electricity at high speed. The move always goes first and results in a critical hit. Uh, yeah, uh, let's see. What move? Thunder Shock, it's gonna be one of these two. Thunder Wave. Let's get rid of Thunder Wave. I just learned it, but let's, let's forget it already. There we go, one, two, and ta-da! Guys, I want to thank you for over 150,000 views on the very first episode of this series. Thanks to you, leaving over 4,000 likes. This channel is growing strongly, and I'm so happy for you guys. I'm also happy that I learned Zippy Zap. Build a marvelous relationship with your Pokemon. Okay, okay, I can do that. Uh, what's up? There are two types of attacking moves, physical moves and special moves. If your Pokemon's attack status high, teach it physical moves. Okay, I can probably do that. Maybe, why don't you trade Pokemon with your friends? You get a lot more variety by trading. The Pokemon you get in trades grow quickly too. Uh, okay. <laughs> All right, what else? What's up? Oh, that Bill. I've heard that he'll do anything to get his hands on a rare Pokemon, anything at all. Hi, do you want to trade your Rotata for my Rotata? Yes, I do. <laughs> Why not? Mine's, oh, hers is level 12, and it looks crazy. The heck? Sure, let's do it. Offer as a trade. Trade. Oh, I'm so happy. Let's get started. Why are you giving up your, whatever. I don't like either one. But uh, here we go. Goodbye, Ratata. Let's go and do some pneumatic tubes. And this weirdo one's coming through. Is this legit? All right, there it is. Why does it look so different? I don't know why it looks so different. Oh my gosh, it's a dark normal. I love it though, I guess. I don't like it at all, really. <laughs> no, it's cool, I'll go ahead and keep it. Level, what, okay, yeah, put it down, put it down, next. Sure. Were you surprised? My Rotata is from the Alola region. Okay, some Pokemon have different appearances and even types, depending on where they were born even if they are the same species. Well, I'm glad we made that trade. Uh, I'm glad I didn't send it to Professor Oak yet. What's up, my dude? Have you heard about Bill? Everyone calls him a Pokemon fanatic, but with a collection like his, who wouldn't want to brag a little bit? I think people are just jealous. Yeah, they're jelly. They jelly. Where are we going now, huh? We're outside in the town. What is up? Have you heard the legend about the Fountain of Cerulean City? If you throw money into the fountain with your Pokemon, you'll be very close to that Pokemon. Uh, the fountain is shooting out water. Do you want to throw money into the fountain? Yeah, I'll throw in 500. Why not? Hopefully Pikachu grows close to me. All right, there you go. He likes seeing me waste my money. <laughs> he looks happy. P-Dog is happy. Good. Well, let's explore these buildings one by one. Let's talk to some people too. You know the guy who lives in that house there? Nope. He's collected bikes from all over the world. Good for him. And you're making some sort of encyclopedia of Pokemon? That sounds like a fun time. That's not the fun part for me. <laughs> but hey, they, this guy's got bikes? Oh my gosh, look at all those bikes. They all look the same even though they're from all over the world. I like riding on Pokemon, sure, but riding on a bike is pretty cool too. My bike collection is impressive, isn't it? I won't let you ride or buy one, but feel free to have a look. Okay, well, geez. Can I touch? I'm putting my fingerprints on these. Hold on, I didn't mean to even click any of that stuff. All right, whatever. It's a shiny bike, it looks expensive. Are you curious about that bike? Yes. I like simple bikes too. It was a limited edition, popular a while ago. The refreshing color, it costs only a million, only, okay, he's just talking like crazy. I did not even do anything, but I don't have a million. It was cool getting to see all of his rare bikes, but boy, that bike maniac goes on and on and on. Da -na 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 -na. Okay. Well, 
He was a bike freak. What can you say? People like that live in this world. He's got to deal with them. Then there's a giant Pokeball. <laughs> Electrode turned away. All right, sup. Electrode, use Swift. No, 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 not that move. Oh, Pokemon are so hard to control. They say it's up to your skill as a trainer whether your Pokemon listen to you or not. I can even go down here because I don't have cut through. Let's go up here, though. Uh, hey, were you going on a hike? Huh? My dearest Clefairy's head. I was messing with its fur and it got really fluffy and cool, but it got back to normal when I kept messing with it. It looks pretty cool. What are you talking about? What are you, what are you even saying? I think it looks great as is. Boom, what's this one again? This is a shop. Yeah, hey. But the shop has more stuff when I beat the gym. Have you seen a rare candy? I've never found one at the shop. I heard that it makes the Pokemon level up instantly. I have a candy, I haven't used them yet though. Once you defeat a gym leader you get and get a new badge, you should visit the local shop. It should have new items you can buy. It's a sign that you've become a stronger trainer. So there is gonna be a gym in this town, right? I don't know if that's true, but it could be true. I hear it might be true. Okay, so where to? I'm trying to just hit up every single building that I see. What's up, dude? There's a tree growing in front of the Pokemart. It's blocking the way to the route to the south. I think there's a long way around, though. All right, well, I'll, I'll check that out if I get a chance. I wonder if these people actually mind me breaking into their homes. I'm taking care of an injured Pokemon here. Bubblesar is finally is fully recovered, so I'd like to give this Pokemon to a trainer who's caught a lot of Pokemon I can trust. That's me, dude, but I already have a Bulbasaur. Ah, if you've caught at least 30 Pokemon, will you come back to get a Bulbasaur? I already have a Bulbasaur, so I may not re remember to do that. But a spare Bulbasaur, maybe one that's more powerful would be good. I don't know how many I've caught. I've already healed them, so I've already been into this house. This is the gym, right? This is uh, gym leader Misty. Uh, the tomboyish mermaid. I, I bet... Actually, I don't know. See, the thing is, I haven't really played a ton of old Pokemon games. I'm gonna guess they're water type. You're a trainer, too. Collecting Pokemon, battling with Pokemon. It's a tough life, isn't it? No, it's easy. <laughs> I don't know about you, man, but I'm having an easy time. This is easy street. All right. Let's go over here. And... Yeah, we can maybe go around, but... Hey, here's the house here. Hey, what you cooking? Good looking. Only skilled trainers can collect gym badges. I see you have at least one. May I tell you some interesting little bits of trivia about those badges? Yes. Now then, which of the eight badges should I describe? None of them. I'm done. Never mind. <laughs> Never mind. <laughs> Come visit me anytime you wish. Yeah. I don't. You're gonna talk my brain off. What's up here, though? What are we doing? Are we loading in somewhere? Somehow, somewhere? Aha! I'm glad I went through. I got a rare candy. This is to level up Pokemon, right? And I haven't even done that yet, so maybe soonish. Alright. What else we gotta do? Um, there's another uh, building or house over here. They build these houses too close together. How do you even do the yard work between them? Whoa! How's your roof high enough for that guy? I was stopped when I tried to enter a Pokemart with my dear on Onyxie. Uh, that was utterly unnecessary. My Onyxie is such a good boy that goes into its Pokeball in a tight space even without being asked. Oh, good boy, buddy. Good boy. Can I pet him? He says, jam, jam. <laughs> Okay, <laughs> jam jam. <laughs> All right, let's not laugh at him. I, I, maybe that's just how he talks. It's not. Whoa, what are you dressed like? What a shame. The people here were robbed. Someone even saw the thieves escape, and they say it was none other than Team Rocket. To protect the poor owners from this house from further harm, I won't be letting anyone in. Not even a little Rattata will sneak past me. Okay, can I go in? No. Okay. I think that's what she means by no one else can come in. Uh, whoa, it's Kevin. Uh, oh, Z Dog, you've got to. You're not going to believe this. Uh, uh, po po Pokemon, it. it, it ah. 
Whoa, whoa, what's he what's he doing to me? Is he fighting me? Is he under some sort of a trance? What's the deal? All right, Pokemon trainer Kevin. So we got three Pokemon. Pidgey's coming out. All right, it's a flying type, right? Uh, so if I have a flying type, I'm gonna want to use electricity against it, and I actually have uh, my P Dog's level 15. So fight with my new move, the Zippy Zap. It's gonna be a critical. It goes first, and Pidgey is like one hit. Totally super effective. A critical hit. Goodbye, Pidgey. What's next? Uh, did I level up? Almost. Oddish is coming out. Oddish is a grass type. So, uh, flying bug. Let's switch Pokemon to maybe a flying bug, huh? We're talking uh, Butterfree, I think. That's what I'm talking about. He's got both. All right. Butterfree's here. Oddish is here. So uh, I'm gonna do I'm, I'm gonna do a uh, gust move. Take this. That wasn't bad. Super effective. He's using poison powder. Please don't poison me. I also didn't want a Pikachu poison. Butterfree could be poisoned. I don't care about him too much. <laughs> he was poisoned. All right, great. Well, uh, and he was also hurt by poison, but hey, we got the same move to do again. Gust, take a gust of wind to your face. All right, here we go. Come on, Kevin. Oh, uh, what, he's still alive? All right, he gets to do an acid attack on me now. That's just how it works, I suppose. All right, and now it doesn't matter. I can just do tackle, probably, and take him out. Oh, use a potion. Oh my gosh, Kevin, what are you doing to this oddish? Yeah, this tackle is no longer going to be good. I mean, it's okay, but it's... Uh, Butterfree has got to get through this. Alright, he's probably going to use a potion again. Let's do Gust again. Yes, got him. Super effective. Goodbye, Oddish. Alright. P-Dog is level 16. That's perfect. M-Dog's 13. Uh, what else? But okay, it's by poison. Kind of the Eevee. Oh, Eevee! Yeah, so this is, of course, uh, you know, the Pikachu and Eevee game. I don't know what type Eevee is. I, I don't think I've ever really seen Eevee. She's a, she's a normal type, but her weakness is fighting then. So I'm going to switch back to, uh, yeah, Pikachu. Switch Pokemon. She's going to get pounded by P-Dog. Here we go. Get ready for it. All right, so I have a fighting move. I'm ready for this. All right, Eevee. Hello. Fight. And by fight, I mean like double kick fight. Here we go. Wha-bam. That was good. Wha-bam. <laughs> nice. All right. Super effective. Hit twice. Fainted. Kevin, don't you be doing this. You know what you've done. Ooh, okay, I feel a bit calmer now. I got I took some of his money though, I guess. Alright. Ha! Huh, deep breaths. Okay. Let me try that again. Sorry. It does not like me to lose my cool like that. There's a house up ahead where this famous Pokemon fanatic is supposed to live. I wanted to stop by because I thought maybe I get to see some rare Pokemon or something, but what I found and, and don't freak out when you hear this. Whoa, that Pokemon fanatic Bill wasn't there! Instead, there was a Pokemon that talked. Oh no, isn't there a movie trailer like this? <laughs> Eesh, just thinking about it, it gives me the creeps. Don't go in there, Z-Dog. I, I, I'm inclined to go in there, but also I want to see what this person's all about. Route to, oh, this is a big route. I don't know, man, maybe I should just go in, into the gym, right? Let's see. Whoa, jump and jump. They said there was a long way around for this. I don't know even how to get over there. I mean, it sure seems like I have no idea what I would be doing to get down there. Anyway, hey, G the gym's here. The gym's here. What's up? All right. This one's a big one. Whoa, everyone's dressed nice. <laughs> I like this gym. All right. Yo, champ in the making. Misty, the gym leader of the Cerulean City Gym, is a powerful trainer. 
You'll need a Pokemon of at least level 15 if you want to challenge her gym. Show me a Pokemon of at least level 15 if you want to take on the gym. Well, guess what? I got uh, one, actually, P-Dog. Impressive. I see you have a Pokemon that is at least level 15. In that case, head on in, and good luck. All right, good luck to me. Indeed, this is like caught up in plants. I want to fight the swimsuit girls. All right, well, let's go. Uh, I don't know. Maybe they'll jump down. Gym leader Misty, certified trainer's Kevin. Uh, Kevin. All right. Cannonball. Oh, no, nice dive. Hello. Appearing in a glamorous flash, my Pokemon will totally stomp you. Don't be so sure. This water based Pokemon. If it is, it's perfect. Oh, the beauty. Lily, what a beauty indeed. Goldeen is coming out. Oh, yeah, that's a water based Pokemon. Well, P Dog, you're going to shred these fish and have shredded fish. Uh, fight. Uh, yeah, guess what? Zippy Zap. Here we go. Here we go. One hit. One hit. Super effective critical hit. Goldeen fainted. And I got some experience, so sure. Excellent. Butterfree grew to level 12. Bulbasaur is 13. And the beauty lily, blub blub. <laughs> blub blub. All right. Hey, let's fight another one, right? Come on, jump. Blub blub. Hmm, me? I'm a beautiful girl who glides on the water. They're probably distracting me. There's something up their sleeve. They don't even have sleeves. Something up there, well. Violet's here. Shelder. What is Shelder? Oh, it's another water base, right? It looks like a water base. So, guess what? Guess who has a Zippy Zap? It's me. P Dog. Zaboom. Zippy Zoom. Another instant faint. Well, there you go. All right. I'm soaked. <laughs> <laughs> she was very impressed. All right. Hello. I could have taken all three at once. Did you just see that dive just now? Don't you think I'm deserving of a gold medal? Absolutely. On beauty alone. All right. Beauty Daisy. It's these triplets or what? Seal. It's a very, I mean, it looks like a seal. So let's, uh. Let's do it. Here we go. Fight. And zippy zap. And don't look back. I'm going to get you real quick. Boom. Man, uh, just totally destroyed. Super effective. A critical hit. Goodbye, seal. All right. Beauty Daisy. my po Your Pokemon totally deserves a gold medal. Well, I would give it to you instead if I could. So this is interesting. Why did we go around here? Could I have avoided her entirely? Probably not. All right, Misty. Misty, hi, you're a new face. What's your policy on Pokemon? What's your approach? My policy for battle is an all out offense with water type Pokemon. Misty, the world famous beauty is your host. My sweet Pokemon are ready, are you? <laughs> yeah, <laughs> cause I got Pikachu, P-Dog. Of course I'm ready. Gym leader Misty's coming out here. I'm gonna get another gym badge like right now. Psyduck's coming out. Wow, is that a water base? I mean, ducks are water base, so I'm just gonna do the move. It goes first. Zippy Zap. She has two Pokemon to choose from. Got him super quick. Oh, wow. He's just like, oh, my life is over. Who's next? Thank you. Next. Oh, Oddish is 15. Uh, Starmie's coming out. Uh, no, keep battling. I'm, I'm happy with this. This has gone great. Uh, actually, I don't know what Starmie is, but prepare to get hit with a Zippy Zap. Here we go. Get ready! Oh, half. Super effective, though. A critical hit. It's level 19. Psy Wave is coming towards me. Ooh, that was actually pretty strong. Well, I got one more Zippy Zap for you. Misty looks determined, but so am I. Prepare to die. Boom, right in his jewel box. 
super effective. Starmie fainted. And looks like I'm owed a new badge. I'm, hit, I'm level 17 now, right? Nice. Okay. Well, I'm happy and you know it. M Dog is now level 14. And Gym Leader Misty has him beaten. Wow, you're too much. Too much indeed. I got 3,000 whatever for winning. All right, all right. You can have a Cascade badge to show that you beat me. All right. Good job, P Dog. We did it. High fives all around. Cascade badge makes Pokemon up to level 30 from other trainers listen to you. And you can also have my favorite TM, Scald from Misty. Thank you, Misty. It's in my TM case. Uh, TM29 teaches Pokemon the move Scald. Use it on Pokemon that lives in water. Okay. Well, that was fun. I'll talk to uh, you later, though. I used up all my energy with my fantastic dive. Congratulations to moi. Now, is there no other way to go upstairs or anything? Let me go back real, real quick. Real, real quick. And I also need to go to the store to see what might be new in store. No, there's no way to go up there unless I have... I don't know if there's any move that... I don't know. Anyway. Let's go to the store and see if they have anything worthwhile. Uh, I know they told me to go check it out after winning the badge. And I guess guess who won the badge? It was me. You guessed correctly. All right. So, what do you got? What's What's new? Uh, I'm here to buy Ice Heal, Awakening, Escape Rope, Propel, or Dire Hit. Okay, I don't know. Okay. I, I typically don't use this kind of stuff, so we will be on our way. Okay. So all is well for now. And now we are going uh, up top because that's where, we, that's where the path seemed to lead us. And I don't know if these people want to fight or what, but I'll fight them. Route 24, people call this uh, the Nugget Bridge. Beat us five trainers and win a fabulous prize. Think you got what it takes? I do. I do. I just beat a gym leader, so of course I have what it takes. Bug catcher kale. I eat kale for uh, not breakfast. Whoa, what is that? What was that? That looks like a bug. I'm going to assume it is. Uh, if it is, fire would be good. Flying would be good. Rock. Uh, that's only if it's bug. I'm just going to use electricity because it's so low. Zippy zap. Get ready. I should have healed my Pokemon. There we go. Good enough. Critical hit. Maybe I'll heal them after I finish this bridge. This road. Bulbasaur is 14. Poison powder. Yeah, let's see. Let's see uh, what what moves we can choose here. Poison. He doesn't have any poison, so maybe uh, we can get rid of. Uh, let's see. A poison powder poisons the target. Tackle growl. Let's forget growl for the poison powder. Sure. Why not? Bulbasaur forgot growl and learned poison powder. Oh, and he wants to learn the move sleep powder. Okay. Why two? What's sleep powder like? I don't know. I'm okay. I don't want sleep powder anymore. Woo, good stuff. All right, thank you, by the way. And uh, you're number two. I'm second. Now it's serious. With a threatening undertone in her voice. You're challenged by Lass Alley. Psyduck's coming out. Well, we know what Psyduck is. Psyduck is going to get totally messed up with Zippy Zap. I'm on a Zippy Zap streak. You can call me Zippy Zap Zack. Don't call me that. Don't actually. <laughs> All right. Boom! There you go. Shouldn't have used a side duck. I just beat one of those. A critical hit. Yeah, it's just gone, dude. All right. How could I lose by using side duck when I have a Pikachu with Zippy Zap? That's how you lost. I have to explain everything. 
Here's number three. I won't be easy. I don't believe you. <laughs> I don't believe that kid at all. All right, youngster Timmy coming out with uh, one Pokemon is a Sand Shrew. I want to say it's a ground type. And if it is, electricity won't be useful. So I might just fight it with like a quick attack or maybe a double kick or something. Not the best, but hey, we're getting stuff done. Sand attack, you're ready. Sand in my face, such a disgrace. Uh, my accuracy, I don't like my accuracy falling. I'll try again with the double kick, it seems pretty good. Got him once, one more time please, thank you. Sand shrew, felt the bottom of my shoe. All right. Well, uh, okay. Oh, Pidgey wants to learn the move Wing Attack. Sure, let's let's see what uh, Wing Attack can replace. It's a flying. Uh, it's a flying move. It's power of 60. Holy goodness. Uh, Gust. Uh, Wing Attack. I yeah, forget Gust. There we go. Did you learn wing wing attack? Good for me. Good for it. Oh, stopped flat. All right. Don't sweat it, kid. I'm number four. Getting tired. Getting tired of winning. Let's continue, though. Last rally. Meowth. Now, uh, Meowth is going to be really interesting because um, Meowth is a normal, but the weakness is fighting, and I have fighting in me. Uh, furthermore, it's only level 10. What's Fake Out do? Ow! I can't move! Oh, you dork. Fine. Double kick again. Let's try it. Boom! Ha! One kick takes out Meowth, especially at this level. All right. Hit you, baby, one more time. Butterfree's 13. I don't know that I'll be using Butterfree anymore. Uh, wants to learn Poison Powder. Nah, keep bold moves. I don't care about Poison Powder. Oh, but Stun Spore, maybe. It is a Grass move. So Grass Bug and Flying, that'd be cool. Oh, it paralyzes the target. Harden. Yeah, forget Harden. Let's do Stun Spore. Let's, let's give you some options, right? Excellent. No, no, no. Keep all moves. I don't need Sleep Powder. He has like three moves to choose from. Holy cow. I lost two. That you did, lass. All right. Squeeze me up here. Last but not least. Okay, I'm number five. I'll stomp you. Enough with the threats. You guys don't even deliver on these threats. Camper Kevin, though, is here. Growlithe. Whoa, is that a fire type? I don't actually know. Uh, Growlithe is a fire type. Weakness against water, ground, and rock. So... <laughs> uh, but electricity's fine, so let's just use Zippy Zap, right? It's just gonna be, it's just gonna be normal. Goodbye. I didn't even have to overthink it. We got him. Camper Kevin. Whoa, too much. I got two great balls. All right, that was super cool. Well, now what? There's a prize at the end, right? Is there you my prize? Not like that. You beat our five trainers. You just earned a fabulous prize. A nugget from the mysterious trainer. You put the nugget in your bag. Is it chicken nugget? By the way, kid, how would you like to join Team Rocket? No, that's right. Oh, great. We're a group dedicated but to doing evil using Pokemon. Want to join? Are you sure? Come on, join us. I'm telling you to join. Okay, you need convincing. I'll make you an offer you can't refuse. Okay. 
Team Rocket sneaks up again. It's just the grunt, though. He has two Pokemon, though. All right, Zubat is here. Zubat is a flying type, and of course, flying type is gonna be weak to electricity. So pretty much anything I do is just gonna wreck this Zippy Zap. I need to recharge that, by the way. By letting my Pokemon rest, most likely. Goodbye, Zubat. All right, critical hit, who's next? Who is next? All right. Coughing. What is coughing? Uh, let me just look it up really quick. Coughing is a poison type. It's weak against psychic. I don't think I'm gonna have that. So uh, I'm just looking. You know, electricity's fine. Ground is good. Psychic's good. I don't really. You know, I'm just gonna keep battling. I'm gonna be fine. Coughing is gonna come out. I'm gonna have a move that goes first. It's gonna be okay. Here we go, Zippy Zap. I'm almost out of my Zippy Zap powers, though. Will this finish him off in one hit? No, but so close. Is he gonna use Tackle against me? All right, that's fine. Let's fight one more time, Zippy Zap, because he goes first. Here we go. Lots of good fights. Goodbye, Coughing. We're not gonna be joining Team Rocket today. In fact, we're gonna work to stop you. We don't agree with your... your political platform of doing evil. <laughs> P-Dog is level 18 now, fantastic dude. All right, well, he wants to learn the move Light Screen. What does Light Screen do? It's a psychic move, that's kind of cool. Uh, maybe I should get rid of Quick Attack. Everything else is good, Light Screen does what? Oh, I wonder if put a reduced damage from special attacks for five turns. I don't know, man. Uh, uh, hmm. Sure. He just learned light screen. Why not? Protects me for five turns. I can't really turn that down. Ah, uh, you're you're good. Of course I'm good. I know what I'm doing here. All right, with your skills, you could become a top leader in Team Rocket. Come on, think of the opportunity. You shouldn't let a chance like this pass you by. Where'd he go? I'm gonna go heal my Pokemon, all of them, because that was a, a great fight, but it took a lot out of me. We're back in Cerulean City. These cities are kind of small. Oh, it's right here. Sorry, excuse me. Still don't have cut through, but I'm gonna heal up right here. We, we beat all those people on the bridge. All right, yes, we would like to rest our Pokemon. Excellent. Hurry up and make him good. Bow, 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 bow. All right, your Pokemon should be all better now. Hope to see you again. Thanks for Zippy Zap, you circus freak. <laughs> all right, where are we gonna go? We're gonna go this way. Back across the bridge, except we won't have to fight anyone this time. And I just kind of want to see what's going on. Wait, can I go over here? Yeah, but there's just no reason to. I just want to see um, what's going on on Route 24, other than these guys that just wanted to fight me. If it's just a bunch of fights, I might, you know, not really care too much. I saw your feet. I saw your feet from the. I saw your feet from the grass. My feet, like as in the thing that I did that was great. What are you talking about? Camper Shane. Howdy, Camper. Spiro is going to be a uh, flying type. So Zippy Zap's going to work for me, probably. I'm not over it. We're still going to be using Zippy Zap until the end of time. Super effective. Critical hit. All right. Camper Shane, I thought not. All right. Whoa! 
That was cool. I got three raspberries. I'm gonna go and catch this guy. Hey, buddy. <laughs> he just looks cool. Gotta catch him all, right? Venonaut. Nat, Venonat, I don't know. He's I mean, he's jumping all around. Don't, what, are you trying to attack me, dude? You need to be polite. That was almost perfect. I just, a little late on that throw. I don't know if he'll lock in, I hope he does. I prefer it, when, there we go, I prefer it when they do. I like the victory music too. All right, Oddish Nim Dog leveled up. I wonder, I should probably slip in some other people to level up while we do this. I don't know who, but we could probably, you know, start working on some others. He's level, it's a bug poison. What level? I don't know. What, it didn't say anything about him, did it? Did I miss it? I don't know. It's okay. Sup, dude? Can I have that? Thanks. I want your Charmander. Is that Charmander? I'm not good at raising Pokemon. I feel sorry for my Charmander because it's not getting stronger. So I want to give it to a better trainer. Yeah, I'm interested. Yes. If you, I've caught 50 Pokemon, but you should catch more than that. Oh, come on. No, give them to me. I'm going to steal them. I'm not going to steal them, I guess. Uh, I guess I won't steal them. All right, Route 25. Whoa, another one of those dudes. Uh, Zup, you want to fight or something? I just got down from Mount Moon, but I've still got gas in the tank. All right, cool. <laughs> You're challenged by Hiker Franklin. Hiker Franklin sent out Onyx. Big, big, big. Uh, I want to say... Onyx, is he ground? I think he might be gone. Ground. Uh, I misspelled. Hold on. I'm, I'm looking it up. Yeah, he's weak to water, ground, ice, grass, steel, fight. Guess who has fighting? Me with a double kick. To wherever. I don't know where is it. Face. Oh, man. That's still, still pretty. Okay. Super effective, but still. Not the best rock throw. Ouch. You bonked my head. Double kick again. Here we go. Let's kick it. Let's kick him in the face. All right. Super effective. Indeed. All right. Everything's good. You worked hard. I did. I did. True. Uh, so here's a question. Was Mount Moon the place that I went to last episode? I think so. I think I was in Mount Moon before. Excuse me. All right. Whoa. Okay, I already have one of those. It's okay. Perfect. Probably going to fight all of these. There's a super potion here. Sup. I had this feeling. I knew I had to battle you. How did you know? How did anyone know? Youngster Chad. Diglett. Diglett's a ground type, right? He has to be. I'm going to try fighting again. Oh, I meant to switch out Pokemon, didn't I? Double kick. Boom. Stomp his head in. Like whack-a-mole. Alright, he fainted. Bulbasaur is 15. Alright, we did pretty good. We got three Pokeballs. Oh, uh, let's look at my party. Or my bag. Pokemon box. I got a lot of Pokemon. Um, I guess not too many. <laughs> okay, so we have uh, level. Let's, let's switch out this. Remove from party. All right. This is level 12. Level 5. Level 3. 
Uh, Sand Shrew. This is a ground. Magic Carp. Let's put Magic Carp in there. <laughs> no. I don't know. Uh, I could put Geodude in. Um, I don't know who to work on, though. Let's put someone who's... Let's put Clefairy in there. Sure. Add to party. Right there is fine. Uh, maybe we'll remove Oddish for now. I just want to get some more leveled up, you know? Sand Shrew. Alright, that this is a good mix-up, right? And then what the heck. Let's get rid of... Uh, Let's get rid of, uh, let's see. I'm trying to think. But should I get rid of Bulbasaur for now? And let's put a Magic Carp in there. <laughs> Just level them up. I mean, why not, right? There we go. That's not too bad. And then I could also get rid of Pidgey. Yeah, let's get rid of uh, Remove from Party. And then we'll put in uh, Spiro. Wait, is Pidgey the same thing as Spiro? Maybe. Let's put in... Uh, uh, and Zubat. There we go. This should get my guys leveled up pretty well. Uh, just give me some more options, you know, just to, in case. I don't know what the next place is going to be, but local trainers come here to practice. Well, then let's practice. Let's have some fun. Bird Keeper Joey. All right. That is a big boy, but guess what? I got a big electrical shock for you. With Zippy Zap. Because I'm Zippy Zap Zack. Here we go. What's going to happen? These are getting stronger, so. Oh. Complete and utter destruction. Alright. Goodbye. That's going to be some XP. That's a lot of XP. You're decent. I'm more than decent. I just totally wiped you out. One move. All right. Dad took me to a great party being held on the SS Ann at Vermilion Port. It was fun. Good for you, kid. <laughs> Good for you. I don't have a dad. Youngster Dan. I think I just have a mom in this game. Ekans. I, I never remember what Ekans is. It's a freaking snake. All right. What is what is Ekans exactly? It is a poison type. Its weakness is psychic and ground. Uh, if it's poison, though, I mean, like, I can still use electricity, right? Yeah, no one's going to say anything. Here we go with Zippy Zap. <laughs> Everything Zippy Zap today. But it's worth it. Gotcha. Whoa, that was strong. Critical hit. All right. Ratata, sure. No, uh, Rat Ratata is, is it a normal or, or what? It might be just a normal. I can't tell. Uh, yeah, it is. So it's weak, weak to fighting, so we're going to keep battling. I'm going to punch this rat in the face. Or kick him, rather. It's called double kick, so it would make sense that I would kick him instead. Twice, though. One is all I need. Gotcha. Super effective. Hit one time. Fainted. Sand true. Grew to level seven. Magikarp is level 6. Youngster Dan. I'm not mad, he says. I don't believe him. I think he's he's secretly seething. Alright, well, let's, uh... Let's get a move on. Hey, you're another person. A lot of fights through here. I'm off to see that Pokemon Fanatic guy at the Cape. Alright. Good luck with that. You are challenged by Hiker Nob. Hello, Nob. Who names your kid Nob? Geo dude's coming out. I don't want to use uh, if it's a if that's a ground type. I think it is. I don't. I do not want to use electricity because it's like null. Doesn't do anything. Uh, but I could use. Uh, he's level 14 though. Uh, ground is weak against grass, ice, and water. I don't think I have anyone. <laughs> uh, I think I took everyone out. 
Okay, you know what we're gonna do then? I'm just going to we're gonna start off with uh, a light screen to protect me a little bit. Stealth rock. Whoa. Pointed stones float in the air. What the heck? I'm gonna do double kick. This guy, man, I don't know if I have the stuff to fight him. Oh, wow, the kick works, okay. Nice. Just keep in mind, the electricity is not effective, so I gotta rely on this double kick. He's storing energy. I'm, I'm gonna kick your face, dude. Yes! All right, what's next? Super effective. That Well, that was super effective? Why? Is fi uh, fighting is super effective against nor Is he normal? No way. Oh, he's a rock type. Oh, is he, he must be a rock type. I'm such an idiot. I don't know why I thought he was ground. I totally forgot that uh, rock was a thing. So, rock types. Uh, water, grass, fighting, ground. Okay. And steel. I don't have any steel. All right. Who's next? Machop. What? In that's a fighting type. It sounds like a fighting type, right? Let's see. Machop. It's a fighting. It's weak against uh, psychic, flying, and fairy. With fighting, though, um, we're talking about, you know, still able to use pretty much all my moves as is. So I'm going to... No, I didn't mean to switch. Let's keep fighting. All right, here we go. Machop. Uh, let's fight him. I'm going to use my zippy zap. Here we go. Hiya! That was pretty good. That was pretty effective. A critical hit. Low kick. I saw that coming. Zippy zap one more time. Come on. Alright. He should be done for. I'm having fun. What can I say? Zubat's level 8. And Hiker Knob is in beaten. Nice. Three Pokeballs, in fact. There are so many people to fight over here. I'm a picnicker. My boyfriend is a camper. Well, I'm gonna I'm gonna steal you from your boyfriend. Cause I'm I'm a Pokemon trainer. Goldine! Aha! Haha! Guess what? It's a fish out of water, but it's still weak to electricity. Zippy zap is gonna be your destiny. I might hit level 20 with this. Pikachu today. P Dog. Super effective. Destroyed. Critical hit. Fainted. Everyone. We're having a good time. Clefairy is a level 11. My conditioning isn't the best. Okay. <laughs> is this your boyfriend up here? I'm a camper. My girlfriend is a picnicker. I wish you would move so I could get that item behind the tree. What do you got here? Dustin. Squirtle. That's another water type, right? Don't worry, P-Dog has got this, absolutely. Fight, zippy zap. Goodbye. Critical hit once more. These guys are collapsing in front of me. Aw, oh, man, he says. Two more great balls. Give me all your balls. All right, and then over here. I think we're almost done with this trail. My friend has many cute Pokemon. I'm so jealous. Don't be jelly. How am I supposed to get 50 Pokemon by now? Oddish is coming out, a grass type. Uh, so I can use, you know, I can use something like, I, I can't use uh, electricity, unfortunately, but I can go ahead and uh, use double kick, probably. Oh, that wasn't very good. No, I guess I misread it. Uh, so Oddish is more than a 
Oddish must also be ground? Hold on, what's the deal? Oh, he's a poison. A grass and a poison. So, okay. Well, okay, let me just switch Pokemon. I don't know if Zubat's strong enough. Does Clefairy have psychic abilities? I don't remember. No, he's fairy. Uh, ground, water. I'll bring out Zubat. I don't know if this is gonna work though because he's so weak. But let's see what, what happens here. Absorb, okay, great. Yeah, that was pretty effective, honestly. Even though it says not very effective, that was effective. All right, uh, wing attack. I too have absorb. <laughs> Whoa, that was good. And it happened to be a critical hit too. This acid might bring me to half health, yeah. It says it's not very effective, but guess what? It really, really is. This is a, this is a zoo bat. Just, I'm, I'm so lucky that I'm surviving this. Okay, super effective, Oddish fainted. So he's a grass poison, keep that in mind. Uh, what else are they gonna send out? Sandrew's level eight, that's good. Sand attack, great. Magikarp seven. Uh, Pidgey, so we're gonna switch back to, uh, yeah, switch Pokemon. We're gonna switch back to uh, P-Dog here. Maybe hit level 20, I don't know. Here we go, get ready for it. <laughs> All right, Pidgey's coming out. Uh, since it's flying, it's not gonna like Zippy Zap very much. So here we go. Bam. Super effective. All right, goodbye to you. Well, we did great. We did absolutely great. M Dog's level 16. Haley's been beaten. I'm not jealous at all. You just said you were jealous. I thought. Are you tricking me? Alright, well, uh, let's continue onwards. What's up with you? You're going to see Bill first. We battle. Alright, we're probably going to stop the video right before Bill. Because who knows what's going to be in there. You were challenged by Fisherman Wayne. You got some fish for me to fry? Guess so. Magic carp, uh oh, uh oh. He's got two fish. I have a magic carp in my party right now. Zippy Zap is my best friend in the world. I've used it like so much today. All right. Goodbye, magic carp. What's next? What, what, what are you gonna send out next? Uh, Krabby, another another water-based one, I'm pretty sure. Let's keep battling with this particular, uh, P-Dog. Look at that, look at that, look at that. Fight again with Zippy Zep. I need to charge it up already. I only have six left. Five left after this. All right. Boom. Beautiful. Super effective. Goodbye. All right, I'm not gonna hit level 20 today, but Zubat grew to level nine. And he learned Bite. And I beat Fisherman Wayne, you're something. Thank you, I guess. All righty, well, uh, before, you know, I, this is a good stopping point. You know, I do wanna go in here, uh, but there's so much, so much that might happen that I, you know, I wanna be sure to capture that. I'm gonna walk this way just real quick to see what could be back here if we were to backtrack. Anything special, I don't know. It is a long way, uh, let's see. Now, yeah, maybe this could be worth it to do this now, maybe? Am I, no, oh, nope, that wasn't worth it. <laughs> well, we'll get back, we'll get back to it. Thanks for watching, come back next time for more, I'll see you then. I'm Zach Scott, subscribe if you have not. If you like this video and wanna help this channel grow, all you gotta do is click the like button below. Thank you so much for watching. Check out these other awesome videos. Follow me on Twitter and Instagram. Join my Discord, and if you want cool shirts like this, visit zackscott.shop.